rally the troops, boys and girls, because today we are back in a Game of Thrones for a surprise, yes, that's right, a surprise episode, oh, playing as none other than the beautiful babies of Bear Island. Here we stand as House Mormont, playing as Jorah, our papa, the old bear over there. Anyway, I thought I'd make one more of these. I need to move my mic. I thought I'd make one more of these before we continued on and started our own series. And so that's what we're going to do. Um, we're going to put some people that are actually competent in positions of power because it doesn't really make sense that all these people are so bad at it. And then we're going to get on our merry way. Fighting the... Actually, let's do that. Fighting the dastardly... Targaryens. There we go. That looks fine to me. We're going to pick a martial lifestyle. Do a chivalry focus. And we're going to send for a maester. And then, because we're at war... We're going to raise our modest sum. <laughs> our modest sum. Oh, look at his armor! Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. This is technically my liege, Eddard Stark of the North. And we're gonna march south. I really wish this song would end. This is our new maester. We're just gonna... It's, we're probably gonna get there by the time the war is over. Oh yeah, let's join. Offer to join the war. And then we're gonna we're gonna help in our own little way and see who the enemy is. Who are the nearest belligerents that we can fight? Because we are very far away. <laughs> like incredibly so. We are not close whatsoever. Um, but we're gonna we're gonna do our part. I think we're gonna we're gonna head south. So here we go. My wife has pneumonia. She was successfully treated. He doesn't like me. We're gonna... I wanna focus in on these boys right here. Okay. Which I'm leading, by the way. And our march begins. My marshal has left there. For some reason, they're not here. My player heir is my aunt. I don't understand. Wait a minute. Is this the one whose daughter is, uh... Lyra, yes. That's right. This lady's definitely not going to live. We are heading south to siege the province of Lake and whatever. And I'm too small. But we're going to hold out, men. Although, honestly, in 18 months, the war will be over. So I'm going to head over here. Help the Tullys. I'm gonna help with one thing. The trident's mouth. I'm an aspiring blade master. Well, isn't that nice? We have a few captains. We could recruit a couple lord, you know, little lads. I don't know what it just came up. And we're down here, fighting this war. We're losing somehow. Not good, only goal right now is to win. Only goal. We'll worry about ruling the kingdom later. We gotta help in this rebellion. Bear Island will do its part. I'm being raided <laughs> like crazy. Heading north. The spoils of war. 21 months. Too long. Way too long. Um, a lot of stuff going on over here. Then we're gonna head over here and help the Tullys. Or well, actually, these are the uh, the errands. Oh, we're gonna help. Get in there. Ooh, that's gonna be a sick siege. She's definitely gonna die, which is fine. What is this town? Who's who is this? Grafton? I'm unfamiliar with that house. Somebody who knows more than me can uh, explain that to me. Do we do it? Help them get in there. 
Nice. Bear Island is helping House Aaron for some reason. I don't know how we're losing. We're taking everything. There we go. Get in there. Uh huh. Stunning. Take the island. Give it to us. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay. Besieged by who? Who's in this army with us? Oh, Eddard's here. Oh my lord. And Robert's here. Oh my god, we're in the thick of it, y'all. We are in the thick of the action. We are in that. This also looks phenomenal. It is a great render. Wait. Y'all. Hold on. My wife died. Let's do alliance power. I need... Ooh, that's a baby. That's a literal baby, but... That one's almost too good to pass up. Where is Kraken Hall? Alright, hold on. Really close to the Iron Throne. Wow, interesting. Is there anybody in the north? Northman. Anywhere. Okay, hold on. Wait a minute. God, the north is humongous. How many, how many, how many? Oh my god, y'all suck. Okay. A Barrow Town? Uh, uh, uh. This one looks like it's good. Let's do that one. Nice. I married an 11 year old. How very Jora. <laughs> I'm the only one here. Where's everybody going? Okay, everybody went here. I have to help. Go south! Come, boys! Huzzah! Wait a minute, where am I? I'm commanding another army? Which army is that? <laughs> oh, I was allied to the Glovers. Oh, God. This is scary. This feels very ominous. Like, uh... Oh god. To war, man. We're gonna f we're gonna lose. Oh no, we're not. This is a huge battle. I'm the commander. Oh my god, I'm winning. We won. And so the bell rings. Let it be known far away from Westeros to Essos and lands beyond the Mad King has been per has perished. Valar Morghulis. And so... Lord Elden of the Stormlands has risen up. All right, that guy's going to pay dearly for that. I'm going to petition my liege, which is... Is Eddard only 21? He's a baby. Absolutely, that's why I just said, oh, what, what am I? I'm his marshal. Wow. How fortuitous is that? We are so far away. The high chiefdom of the Bay of Ice. I don't know if Bear Island would really want anything to the north. It doesn't really make sense to take anything up there. We have a small god's wood. Probably a forestry. I feel like we would have that, considering. So we won the war. Um, we're gonna raise all of our men again. The soldiers of Bear Island will come to your aid. We are very small, but we are mighty. Uh, 
I will join your war, my liege, my lord. I will head south. I probably won't get there in time. I cannot have... They wouldn't do this. This would not happen for real. Look at the distance between us. We would have to... We literally have to circumvent the entire world just to get there. But I'm gonna do it anyway. Oh. I'm gonna ransom this guy. Who wants a position? What do you want to do? Um, you kind of suck, my man. The only one you're remotely good at would be this. I don't want you to be the spy master, so you're just going to have to kind of suck it up for a while, okay? All right. Nice talking to you. Let's see. Where am I at? Wait a minute! What the hell? Eddard, he died? <laughs> oh my god. Who, who is this? Benjen? Rickard? Who are these people? Oh my god. <laughs> Wait a minute. What is this amalgamation of garbage? The last lands? House Umber? Sure, I'm Marshal of the North once more. Good God. This is nightmarish. Am I still heading south? I really don't even know. Ooh, we got some cool, we have some cool unique uh, soldiers, Wolfswood. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Over here yet? Oh my god. Alright, we're coming. The war's still going. The men of Bear Island know our cause. We are here to help. And help we shall. New Marshall perk. I'll do that one later. Also, Jorah does not look like this. This man... This man does not look like this. <laughs> I'm gonna get wrecked, watch. Watch him die. I feel like this mod uh, makes it so that death is so much easier to come across because enemies just like, it's it's like Game of Thrones. <laughs> Crazy. But enemies literally just die like that. It's like nothing. How's Karstark? Ugh, I always knew they were suspect. Suspect. House Umber is pretty sick, though, to be honest with you. Wow, it's wood in here. Oh my god. Look at a little lobster. What in the hell? Alright, that's a sick name. By Lord Kranagman. Is that an ermine? What the hell is that? Am I the only one over here? I'm the only one over here. <laughs> oh man. I feel like the sheer amount of chaos that can ensue is enough reason to, for people to want to play this mod because it is. What is this? Oh, I see. Ooh. Because there's so much shenanigans that can just go on at any moment. So we're just sieging. Oh wait, I'll turn it on four. Sure. I increased my learning by two. Wow. Oh my god, his prowess is what? Does he have the sword? Oh, long claw baby. Mm-mm-mm. Jon Snow sword from the series, obviously. Wait a minute. Do you know what? I didn't even think of that. 
<laughs> because I'm his marshal. I'm at war anyway. Like, I'm already in the battle. So this army down here is just, you know, secondary. Really, I need to start having some kids, you know? Heavy Maul? That is a sick name. Sick name. I'm gonna... Oh, God! Oh! Well, we did a Valiant. We had a Valiant go of it, kids. That was terrible. Let's go here. <laughs> God. Oh, man, it took us so long. We were so close. Oh, we did it. What do we get? Good for us. Everybody go home. Sure. Who wants a council position? Are you the one who I just... No, you're not the one I freed. I don't have any money. With what? You want me to recruit you with what? With what? The Iron Throne. A grand melee. Time to, time to break some bones. Let's do it. I arrive at the grounds of the Grand Melee alongside Warrior. This is some sick armor. Look at my lad. Look at this. Look at this Chad. Some of them seem a little more than green boys. Hardly able to swing their swords while others bear the scars of many a campaign and battle. The only thing that unites all of them is courage. The melee ring is not for the faint of heart, but bravery alone will not carry the day. I intend to make my foes rue the day they stepped into the ring with me. Yeah. You're coming with me. You know what I watched? I watched Shrek yesterday. Huh? What? <laughs> A four-year-old just told me I couldn't be Marshall of the North. Okay, I finished Unconquered. I see grizzled veterans, accomplished ma masters of arms, and hungry lordlings eager to prove themselves dangerous fighters one and all. I will wait my patiently for my name to be called. Look at how strong this boy is. He's a mountain of a man. All right. According to both myth and maester, on the island of Skagos, there lay a unique and puzzling beast now extinct from the mainland. It is a shaggy and powerful beast that has, been repl that has replaced the horse in this part of the world. On its head is a single long horn that is highly valued by traders across the known world. The Skagosi ride this beast into battle whenever conflict calls. And together, Skagosi and beasts feast on the flesh of their slain foes. The beast is none other than the Unicorn, a ferocious beast capable of holding its own against the likes of even dire wolves. The Unicorn is no beast to tempt, and that is why the Skagosi have domesticated them. Skagosi seems like a thrilling place. I would love to visit one day. That's really cool. All right. At first I thought the simple footman a fool for stepping out of the battlefield. Oh, I see. It's this one. This peasant and my soldiers will get a lecture on honor. Now I gain some stuff. The grand melee of Grailheart. Where is Grailheart? Let's uh, set the scene. So whose house is this? With the hammer, I seek wisdom. House had Lord Rickard. Of the Rills. Is this in the west? Uh, I think so? The Rills. Is this the Riverlands? I cannot tell. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's go Kingdom Tower. Oh, it's in the north. We're gonna fight uh, this guy from House Rossell. Single combat. All right. For a brief moment, we pace in lazy half circles, each watching for an opening. I heft my long claw, ready to defend myself. All right. Uh, I'm going to attack first. Putting all my strength into my first strike, I leap straight for Dennis, half hefting my sword high into a powerful cleave that sends him reeling. Dennis retaliates with a smooth flowing series of quick slashes and powerful cleaves, each strike forcing me back a little more. My form is good, with only small arrows, and his stance is formidable. 
I'm the fastest blade in Bear Isle. I, in battle, I'm an artist. Every strike is a breaststroke. Every fallen foe or gout of blood a splash of paint. As I brandish my sword, switching seamlessly between flourish and strike, I paint a picture of agony across my foe. Then it cracks his neck, then starts raining blows against my guard. A marathon of powerful cleaves that almost break me with their relentless ferocity. My form is excellent. Let's see. I'll show you how I have to sword. It flows like water, each cha strike chaining fluidly. Fluidly, yes, into the next. A series of perfectly timed attacks. He cracks his neck, and he does it again. And I'm going to be the fastest blade, and I have won. I whirl my sword with a deadly flourish, weaving a song of pain across my opponent with every blow. There is an art to true combat, and I am nothing, if not artistic. Only when Dennis has been beaten to a near stupor do I deliver the final blow, disarming him with one smoothly powerful cleave that sends the man's sword flying. I prepare myself mentally and physically to run him through, pausing perfectly the second my opponent yields. I am victorious. Did I win? Who the hell is this? A man from House Umber. Very high likelihood of success because he's sick. He kicks my shin. Oh. Strike, parry, and repost, and a quick victory. Few men can withstand my barrage of powerful cleaves, and my opponent is no exception from nowhere. Harmon flies forward, aiming a vicious kick exactly at where my shin was a moment ago. Surprised by my unexpected shift, my foe ugh, he sails past me, utterly off balance. And I smack him in the face, I'm assuming. All right, now we're fighting this lowborn lad who... I don't even know why he's fighting. I'm going to play it defensively. And then we're going to strike, parry, repost. And then we're going to swing in there with some nice fast blade action. And then we're going to strike, parry, repost again. My sword arm moves fast as lightning and strikes as hard as sundered stone. Blow by blow, I beat my opponent into bloody concussed submission hammering into the ground with all the fury the last hero can lend me when all that's left is a quivering pile of a bleeding man i wonder if i've gone too far the rope then robot coughs hard enough to lose his grip on his dagger and i allow myself a little relief I kick his weapon away and i lay my own against his throat it takes a few tries but robot gets the yield out eventually My body aches, my armor is dented, and my breath comes ragged from my chest, but I stand triumphant, having conquered all challengers in the melee ground. It is difficult to say what is more satisfying, the cheers of the crowd, or the beaten look in the eyes of my opponent as they stumble away defeated. My elation only deepens when Lord Rickard presents me with my hard-earned winnings. This day will live long in my memory. I gain 75 gold, 250 uh, prestige, and get melee winner for five years. Which, if I recall correctly, yeah, you get extra prestige. I was the winner of a grand melee. The Wolfwood is quite large. Oh. My daughter, she had pneumonia. Not my daughter, his daughter. She's 14. She's not, she's kind of, kind of comely. She's also homosexual, so I can't seduce her at all. A lot of our oh, a lot of wolfswood hunters. So that's what we have so far. They're good against skirmishers. Should we have light horsemen? These are good against cavalry. I feel like having pikemen might be a better move. Maybe. This guy's a good fighter. I maybe I should have recruited him. Galbear. He's a wolfswood clansman. This is my culture. Interesting. I don't think I have any wars to declare. Bear Island wouldn't really... I don't even know what you would do. That's See, this is my problem with Bear Island. I wouldn't actually know what I would be aiming for. Because I don't imagine they would, actually, they would really attack anybody. Do their best! I want you to also do your best. <laughs> oh my god. You're not a you're not a strong one. So I'm gonna put oh my god, I can't. I guess you could be my marshal. 
There. I wouldn't. I don't. Re there's not really a reason for me to attack anybody, though. I mean, we can try. We could. We could lay a claim. We could lay a claim. See what happens. The wall. Wait a minute. Is my dad dead? Oh wait, no. Hold on. No, where is he? Oh, he's an admiral. He's not the Lord Commander yet. I'm confused though. He doesn't have um, long, like long claw. Oh, the struggle beyond the wall. Oh, so there's a struggle mechanic up there. That's cool. I didn't know that happened. That's really interesting. Hmm. Oh, I thought it said 177,000 for a second, and I was like, there's no way. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, man. Let's see, I don't have anything to host a melee. I'm gonna meditate at the Weirwood. And just see what happens. Regardless of faith, few places in the world come close to matching the heart of a god's wood in terms of tranquility and otherworldly solitude, but there is no mere, this is no mere relaxing garden to stroll through. The old gods hold sway here. As I approach the heart tree, I desire nothing more than... The blessing of the divines. Your piety does not go unnoticed. I got 50 piety. And I got a martial perk! Wow! Spouse penny plus 50. I'm gallant as hell. I can officially get married. And we have this beautiful... Beautiful military. Now it's time to start pumping out some children. Uh, my lady is quite, quite th ravishing. Um, attentive care by my spouse. Let's see, what, what skills do you have? You have a really nice managed domain. Really nice. Five per turn? That is mwah, stunning, my lady. My aunt has copulated with her lover. Okay. You had a baby out of wedlock! Oh my god, uh, how could you... How could you... I don't even know what to say. That's terrible. For it. Oh, I understand you're interested in deepening your grasp on warfare. Oh. Sure. Forest forts. We definitely need that on this beautiful island of bear. Accused of claim fabrication. What? Me? Me? No. No. <laughs> I don't. I don't know what you're talking about. Claim fabrication. Lack of sheriffs. Do I need to? Oh, I do. Hmm. Huh. So apparently we are missing some sheriffs. My wife is pregnant! Ah ha ha! A grand melee. I gain. I will fight in one once more. For glory! Will Lord Jorah win his second melee? He's cynical, content, brave, and arrogant. A little arrogant. Didn't think he had that. Didn't think that I didn't think that'd be one of his traits. Um. Oh. I, I lost in the early rounds. Oh well. Happens to the best of us, guy. You did win a melee like uh, two years ago. So, I mean. Yeah. So you're, you're fine. Like, you know, sometimes it happens. You know, you'll win some. You'll lose some. That's what they say. What does goad mean? Oh, that's curious. I love House Umbers. I love that. I love what they did with the art. He has, she has shown me the ins and outs of Shovishi. My final test is a mock battle against her to show what I've learned. Prepare the ranks. I gained the trait Reaver. So he is now a Reaver, which means he can raid. But I don't think we get the, um... 
Another melee. I don't think we get the option to do... My new player at... Oh, my son Jor. Harwin would be good. Steven! <laughs> oh, st this is my son. Steven. He's, you're too far away. I need like an actual... Well, Driftmark's not close, though. Driftmark is way south. But that'd be really cool. Um, I need more like a Northman. On ah, the Flint Fingers, you're much too south, but you know you got intelligent, which is would be a good trait. So we're gonna do that. I think he got robust. Oh, he got Herculean. This man is gonna be a fighting boy. I'm gonna I'm gonna raise you. Excellent. We're gonna fight in another tourney, and it shall be glorious. Uh, for glory, let's see what happens. Roos of Flint Finger, Shields of the West. Flint's Finger. I've not heard of so many of these. The Neck. Yeah, I've heard of that. House Reed. Govern me. See, I don't think Reed has um their name. I don't. Is it is it House Reed that doesn't have a name like in the uh? In the book, because I know House Blackwood. I don't think they he said their name either. Which I'd probably be like, okay. You know, like Eyes of the Old Gods or Eyes of the Old Ones. Go Here We Stand is a great, a great motto. Also, Bear Island is a much smaller clan. He stands unconquered. I will wait patiently for my name to be called because I don't feel like watching every duel. Because we did that in uh, one of the other ones, if you remember. And it went bad. I think we fought this guy before. He's really good, actually. Uh... And I win. Beautiful. Lord Gregor the Good of Ironrath. Ah, oh, he's a forester. They have such a cool, such a cool house. From ice, from uh, iron, from ice. I cannot read. Uh. There we go. And there we go. I flow like water, and I beat him. Shall we win another melee? We could. Oh, we gained 50. We are fighting uh, boldness over learning. We're fighting House Snow Rivers. Okay. He also has syphilis. <laughs> oh, I lost. Oh. Dang. Why don't you like me? Wait, the House Melee Widows watches with the Splinter Shields. In the end, Lord Howland stands alone. Oh, he won. So he must have he must have been the final round. Dang. A lot of these rulers in the north are strong as hell. They all have like crazy high. You gotta be kidding me. Another one. House Manderly. Uh, my vassal has arrived outside my castle with a... Oh. He's here to pay homage. Sure. Deposit gold on your left. We're gonna fight again. Dang, it kind of seems like we got lucky that first time. I kind of want to win one. Is she sick? What are you... Why, is, why are all my wives dying? What is it with this island? Is it just too wet? I want the island. Oh, a Bravosi puppeteer has arrived. And it was entertaining. Oh, I lost. 
Skating through the north, my interest has, has been piqued by academic accounts of Northmen using skates fashioned from the bones of sheep and horses to glide across vast stretches of icy waste? Huh? Renter truly caused us to, to innovate? Okay. Off we go now. March to war, men. Riding down and killing all their family. There we are. Battle of the Full Moon. You could stay with me and have another kid before you die of pneumonia. This guy won. It's tough. It's hard to win a melee. You think it's all just, you know, fighting, stabbing people, and then you get wrecked. The men of Bear Island will not stoop to such lows. We captured Kyle! <laughs> oh my god. I love that. Oh. It, it tickles me for some reason to no end when they have just like the most normal name. Peacemaker, peace acceptance plus 10. That's nice. Log forts. Nice. Yeah, nice. That's what we want. Stop. Will you stop inhibiting me? And that's it, kids. Our first war. Buried moon, very nice. Let's promote our culture. Let's convert. Wait, the fire crackles casting long shadows on the wall of the servant's quarters. A wise and old woman holds children agog with her tails. Morose are ancient beings of great power who have lived here since the beginning of the world. Great metalsmiths, the morose are rarely seen above ground. Oh, they're like dwarves. What a fun old tale! What a, what what fun is that? Um, do I have a priest? I'm assuming they have the same faith, then, in this county. <sighs> okay. So it's fine. Our prisoners can be ransomed. Well, there you go. We're gonna fight in the Flint Fingers again. Few captains. We can recruit this guy now. I can have 12 more. Or like 12 total. Jesus. I'm gonna meditate at the gir at the weird wood. Guidance. Guide me to a victory in this tournament, please. Alright, we're gonna fight Lord Baron of Ragged Hold. Keep on strike parry reposting. And I win. Alright, so we won the first bout. Lord Jorah's doing well. Or Master Jorah. God, oh, we have fought this guy. This absolute mountain of a man. Oh, God. My sword arm moves. Oh, I won. My glory is widely known. I can't wait till they do the tournaments because it really seems like the devs who made this have tournaments in mind because they're such a huge part of the gameplay right now. All right. Usually you only have to win three. House Hail. What is theirs? Never wrathful, always loyal. That's nice.
We won! I think there's one more fight. I think you usually have to win three. House Nobly. Nobly? Oh, man. Oh, I disarmed him, spying the perfect opportunity to disarm my opponent. I bring my sword down on a powerful cleave that wrenches his hammer from his grasp. That went surprisingly smoothly, all things told. Damon and I are just left standing awkwardly. He unsure whether to bolt after the weapon or surrender me unprepared for such a perfect execution. Speaking of, I put paid I put paid to any thought Damon may have of continuing the fight with a raised eyebrow and a heft of my sword. The yield is embarrassing, but speedy. God bless, how many of these are there? We did it. I kick him. My body aches, but I am a I am a winner again. Lord Roos, thank you once again, friends, for giving me your hard-earned money. Outposts for sure. That way, if we ever get invaded, we'll be we'll be set. The snow has fallen constantly since the hour of the wolf. As I see my steward enter my throne room, I know the discussion will be detail the effects of the blizzard on my hold. We could offer shelter and food to those caught in this weather, but doing so will disrupt the work going on in the hold. I will not let my people suffer. Did nothing. I will do the noble thing. Bear Island. I mean, we're also not really even an island now because we have two holds. Carve stone. I think, honestly, I think I feel pretty good about that. I think, I think that that's a fun little preview that we just did. We got to fight in the rebellion, like actually fight in it. We took one of those big cities down here somewhere. I don't even remember which one it was. Drivmark is right here. You gotta make Castle Driftmark look cooler than that. Oh, there it is, Dragonstone. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Red Crab of Red Crab of Claw Island. Where is he? Is that where they are? Is that Claw Island? Crabs return. <laughs> Crab people, House Celtigar. Although it looks like they're getting uh, wrecked. They are like one of the last Valerian houses besides the Driftmark people. He has a sick axe. Is that Valerian steel? I almost well, I almost bet it is. Anyway, I thought about playing as the crab people, honestly, to throw everybody off after the vote. But that vote was way... There were way too many of y'all that voted. 160? That's insane. That's like the biggest poll I've ever done. So, starting in June, you will see this every week. This is the very last preview that I'm doing. I promise. Fingers crossed. Everything will go smoothly so that we can start recording by the middle of the month once the um, tournament's DLC drops. Hopefully it updates and gets implemented into this mod seamlessly so that we can just go straight into playing and it's going to be great. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been, once again, a Game of Thrones mod for Crusader Kings 3. We are House Mormont. Here we stand on Bear Island. It was a fun little bout, fun little preview, one last episode before we continue on and head into the month of May. And I will see you in the next one.